You're taking a behind-the-scenes look at CEO Mr. Rufus Godchild Morris and Kingdom Entertainment Companies. Our mission is to entertain, inspire, and educate through music, live performances, film, radio, TV, and other multimedia platforms. The educational component of our mission is realized through our performing arts after-school program called School of the Hearts. Our corporate objective is to raise social awareness of how multimedia, visual, and performing arts play a major role in shaping the minds, hearts, and behavior of individuals in society, and how these two can be used for positive change in our culture and communities. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. My, my, my flow had you amazed and astonished. Perfect. Keep making music. Do a little producing. Yeah, School of the Arts, what we do is more than music. Ashley's vocal is going to come up in this session. I'm just going to... School of the Hearts After School program offers two areas in digital music production. Kathy Blackwell students explore computer-based technology to simulate a complete music production studio. Takes it to the beginning of the session. That's nice. Students in Doolittle's group learn digital DJing techniques by using a variety of technologies to produce and engineer their own music. Everything else from her vocals all the way up to the top of the beat. To me, it's not at the top of my list that they all come out the next American Idol, but that they come out at least seeing a value for learning. Today, we're going to just do some review on recording. We're going to hear. My name is Kathy Blackwell, and I'm connected with the School of Hearts, and I teach their audio, music production, producing, engineering. Ashley, just help her out a little bit. I press the mic, you press it, and then put me on mic line. See, what's good, Ashley, is you help her, it's just going to help you to retain it and learn it more when you teach it and help her. I help the students develop vocally and learn how to manipulate the different DAWs, which are digital audio workstations. Now, sometimes you run into digital glitches or difficulties. So There's a lot of them out there, from GarageBand to Fruity Loops, Reasons, Pro Tools. I teach them how they can, on their own, um, have these right in their home and make their own music. Okay, Ashley, get ready. You're just going to rehearse with it a little bit. My program prepares students for a job career in the future by teaching them more than what they may have previously been interested in. Artists can become producers and engineers, DJs as well. My motto is do it yourself and that's what I show them. You can switch to track two to any track while it's in recording and the clap. Nice. Technology part really, they're just tools, you know, they're just utensils. It's like saying, here, I taught you how to use a pen. You take the cap off and you press it down and push it around. What are you going to do with it? That's up to you. What do you want to create? Hit play. Today, I had a couple of students who like to work together on producing the instrumentals, develop a brief instrumental. You got highs, you got kicks, snares. I had another student record that instrumental into the computer through the editing software Pro Tools. Then I had an artist record his vocals, had another artist, a female artist who liked to sing, record her vocals, and then had a DJ add a little something at the end with his mixing and DJing. It became a team effort. Everyone has something to show for it, something to take pride in. Crystal's acting like the assistant engineer. Yeah. She's going to set up the artist, get the mic. Oh. Ashley, would you like to rehearse anything? Yes. OK. And the reason that came up is because that was armed to record there. So it's off now. Okay. So now it should play. OK, so push space bar. Yeah, place space bar starts. It. Today, we recorded on Pro Tools. It's a digital audio workstation. And there's a technique that's used when recording that a, a vocalist will double, which means that they'll just sing that same line again to give fullness to that vocal part. I'm Ashley, and I go to Henniger High School. I'm in the 10th grade, and um, I go to School of Hearts after school. Ashley, just get up there, and we're going to try to do another take on this. I learned a lot of stuff this year. 
that I didn't know last year because last year I wasn't really doing the computer. I was really singing. So this year she taught, Miss Blackwell taught me more about the computer and how to export and make beats and stuff. With Ashley today, we were doing a double on one of her harmonies. Once we got done with that, I was telling them how we could actually change the pitch of her vocal. We, we took a sample from Ashley's and we could change it. See how I'm gonna play this song one more time. Watch the chipmunk, because I could change the pitch. Okay, that's her regular. Now there are certain waves you cannot change the pitch, but it will change tempo. Yeah, you got the kiss, see no ten of the mic. Got my girl Solange, you know the vocals is tight. School of the hearse is like, keep doing Everyone wants to be an artist because that's how they see it. That's who they see on TV. They see the superstars. They see them in the magazines, on the TV. They hear them on the radio. You don't see the person who spent all those hours editing that movie or editing that music. You know, you don't see that even though those people are doing very well. Two, two, three, four, hi hats. Three, four, four, two, three, everything. Yes. And that's why I keep pushing that we mold artists into engineers. All right, so it should be on the flow on the play. That's how my program helps them for jobs in the future, by opening up their minds to more than just the dreaming big and simple. Right, Technology worry. today helps me be a better musician because basically it's all hands-on, it's all in front of me. They're given everything that you need to be a, a musician or a producer. You know how you put her vocal down there? Is it a way how you could put it up between the, the beats and make it only play during those two parts? You can't because you build your patterns first. So I have this on pattern one, pattern two, this is what I have. The audio class that I teach, I feel helps prepare any student who wants to further their career go on is because it exposes them to the basics of it and really to know if they really want to do it. If you could like move that down you can and move. then put a beat right there on pattern two and then move the vocal down to pattern three. That's what I was saying. You want to move it? Yeah. Let's see what it sounds like. See if there's any near, anything near. Now i got to put it in song mode. I get some students and they have this idea of what they think it is. And then when we start to record her, there might be days and I'll say, I'll say, look, this is work too. I mean, you can love it, but you got to know that there's, there's work involved in it. And you might have wanted to do recording engineering, but now I'm trying to show you that there's a problem here and you got to follow the wires. You got to troubleshoot. You got to find out what's going on here. Um, you got to work with artists who might be in a bad mood today. Do you want to do that? you know, for the rest of your life. So, you know, I try to get them to really get it. They're really getting exposed with this program, you know, in both audio groups. They're getting exposed to the fun part, but it's work. Bring her down a little bit more. I would like to become a singer, like an R&B hip hop singer, and just like bring new music for young people to enjoy, for just people my age to enjoy and have fun with it. No time to climb. I think it's time to shine. School of hearts, Turn it down. Turn it up. This step gets you somewhere where you're confident enough in your work and yourself that you might go to the next step and say, you know what, I did it on this level in this after school program. Now I think I can do it at a real business. I think I could really go with this work and this confidence to this place of business, to this record label, to this radio station, to this television show, and I could look for a job or I could intern, I can get involved, and I think, I think I could do it. There you go. There we go, go to bounce the disc. We got it, we finished the song. Hey everybody, Brian, Solange, Brendan, Brandon, let's hear the teamwork. Here's a song we produced in a half an hour. I'd really like to give them something to be proud of, one step at a time.